Hello friends, welcome you on Research Needs. In this video, today we will see study of depressant and stimulant using actophotometer. So we will click and enter into the XFORM software. Now we will click virtual practice actophotometer and enter to start experiment. So while you enter into XFORM software, you will see the interface on that you will find equipment which is known as a actophotometer so what is actophotometer what it consists so actophotometer has a central chamber with a arrangement of light source and photo cells at the base of the two opposite walls so here you can find a actophotometer inside this area it is a center chamber in that you will find a small round type of light source from where you can see here here it is it is producing light and in opposite direction means this side you will find our receivers so from here it produces light and that light beams reach up to the opposite wall the receiver points photo cell receivers so they receive the the beam of the light so this type of arrangement is there so any interruption in the path of the light activate photo cells and this is counted as a measure of horizontal locomotor activity of mice kept in the chamber so the light is means constantly passing through the photo receivers while anything you put there put here in this chamber if it moves the light is interrupt the beam is interrupt so the photo cell receivers measure this means it is counting those things and measure of horizontal locomotor activity means anything move here and there that is counted by the photo cells so this is how arrangement you can find in this instrument so here it has switch from where it is used to give shock to the animals sometimes what happened here it has a grid to while you put the animal inside the chamber and animal is inactive for long time in one place that time you can start this you can give the shock to animals to activate the experiment on next here the it is measurement what level of shock you can give and uh, here it is showing the light to start the experiment and here it is showing the display the it is counting the locomotor index means it is counting the interruptions all the interruptions which is occur just because of animals locomotor activity it is counting from here that it displaying so this was the equipment actophotometer so now we will see its uh, principle so here you will see the photo photometer here animal is placed and here it is displaying the interruptions means count of the interruptions so it is showing the locomotor activity here it is showing grid so now we will go to read this what is the principle the drug acting on central nervous system as a stimulant or suppressant affect the locomotor activity in experimental animals just because of the drugs effect if it is stimulant then there will be a increased secretion of dopamine or norepinephrine or if it is suppressant so it is activating gaba receptors so this type of drugs you are using when we will use stimulant or a depressant the, this instrument will tell you what is the effect of drug 
so now such changes in motor activity can be easily determined by using simple techniques in which the animal treated with the drug is kept in an open compartment and having a square marking on it floor so earlier we have seen motor activity in open field that it has a many squares the number of squares the animal crosses that we are counting and by that we can easily guess what is the locomotor activity so like that it is saying the lines of such squares crossed by the animals are counted by the observer and the number of lines crossed correlates with the locomotor activity likewise here it it has a lots of beams light beams and the animals is crossing that beams just because of that interruptions the beam are not reaching to the photo cells just because of the locomotor activity is increasing and that interruption the photo cell is counting the number of lines crossed correlation with the locomotor activity means the beams it is crossing that correlates with the locomotor activity alternatively the locomotor activity can be determined using actophotometer or more sensitively by using automated video tracking system in addition to horizontal movement and vertical movement rearing standing on hind limbs and exploration of surrounding is also considered as a parameter associated with the locomotor activity so in open field we have seen the rearing animals while it is stimulant conditions animals that time it is showing rear end means stand on the hind limbs and try to observe around this type of sign is called as rearing and uh, in open field we have seen groom like behaviors while the animals is depressed or in uh, nervous condition means anxiety condition that time it uh, try to scratch his mouth that time so this type of behavior it was showing that in, in that experiment so here it is showing rear because here is stimulant condition or depressed condition while it is in depressed condition it not moves that much it uh, movement is reduced and while it is uh, stimulant condition it try to explore around and uh, move more it is showing more activity means low, more local motor activities so now we will see the experiment so here it is showing instructions we will read it animal are divided into two groups six animals in each and uh, administered one group with a drug to be tested and other with a vehicle by oral routes put one animals at a time in the actophotometers start the instrument count the locomotor activity for a specific time your time is around 2 to 3 minutes or sometimes it, it depend on protocol sometimes it is up to 5 to 10 minutes also repeat the procedure at the interval of 30 minutes record the observations the mice in the test group are injected diazepam 1 mg per kg oral and locomotor activity is measured twice as a stated above so we will go and see the experiment you will see all the animals now we will administer the drug here you will see the two groups vehicle treated and drug treated now animal will be divided after administering the drug we will in vehicle treated we have to give the vehicle is saline or in which the drug is dissolved here you can see it is showing diazepam here drug is diazepam so it is a kind of depressant drug it is not a stimulant it is depressant now we will administer the drug here you can see the oral dose is given to the animals so 
so now animals will be divided into two groups so now we will start the we will screen the first animal from vehicle group so we will see what time it is taking we will screen only one one animal from each group from that we will analyze more because it is time consuming so i will speed up and directly after screening one animals from both group i will show you the result we will click first animal so here you can see we have kept the animals into the chamber area center chamber area So here it is showing the activity, it is displaying. And it is stable one place, but here we have showing it is counting. So it is not a second, it is the activity of the animals, it is movement, it, it is the interruptions of the light source, that is it is counting. So here you will see it is showing display, group selected, vehicle treated and locomotor index means this count we will write here and number of rearings. So we are here, we will take one animals for both group, one one animals and we will add the readings directly. So now you can see it is stopped almost. So now we will write here 154 and rearing counts 4. Now we will click from one animal from the drug area so here we, I will click now it is started the drug treated drug treated group we have selected
So here you can see it is showing rearing behavior. So here you can see it is showing only count less and in less speed. While you're doing this type of experiment, that time you should use stopwatch. If your time is for 3 minutes or 5 minutes, you should display that stopwatch and do your practical for both group. So now it is, it is showing we have been first animals we conducted around 3 minutes the counting is stopped so we will write here 60 the locomotor index and rearing around 1. So now we will see the observation. Here you can see locomotor index is around is around double to the drug treated groups so it is showing that and number of rearing is 4 and here average is around 3 to 4 and here rearing is around 1 to 2 so it is reduced up to 50 percent so locomotor index is reduced more than 50 percent and the rearing 50% around and rearing is around it is also around in 50% so it, this is the average so now we will see the that you it is showing that our drug was CNH depressant and it was acting on GABA inhibitory receptors and uh, here the animal was in normal condition so it was showing more locomotor index now we will see the conclusion observed reduction in locomotor index shows that the given test drug diazepam exert inhibition of the locomotor activity so this was the experiment how was the experiment please do comment if you want to know anything else thank you for watching research need thank you thank you very much